Hello everyone, and welcome to this short and sweet technical analysis update. My name is Victor and I'm a coach here at Char Champions. I hope you're all doing very well and that you're ready to dive into the price action as we have just reached a very important level for Bitcoin. So let's get into it. So let's pick up right where we left off. If you remember, two days ago, we were looking at these fresh levels. We have now been able to move our way through two resistances, which I will show you in a second, and are now right up against that daily level at 42,750, which is currently acting as resistance. What does this mean? It means that if you're trading this, possibly from a long position from somewhere down here around 39 or 40,000, when you reach such an area of resistance, you can take profits. No financial advice, do whatever you want. You have to make your own plan in the end. But that's how you can use these levels. If you remember, we were also looking at a Fibonacci retracement pull from the high to the low. The 382 proved to be resistance yesterday and we pulled back quite nicely from it. Today, we've been able to go through the 382 resistance level and into this daily level now, which we are currently working on. Also, we were looking at the volume and this is a pretty big fixed range pull containing data from the beginning of December until now. And as you can see, this big red line in the middle is the point of control which is also a level of resistance if it's above you. Now we've been able to travel through both of these and the daily level could be considered the last stand of resistance in this little area here. If we manage to close a daily candle above this level, for example today, and tomorrow open above it, backtest it as support, that would be very bullish and we can then continue to move up through this daily level here and eventually all the way up to the CC resistance area, which in the past, as you can see, has also been resistance. In other words, we could reject from here and pull back to see lower levels of support, such as perhaps a fresh daily level here at 41,300 approximately, or this 39,670 level. And if that doesn't hold the untapped weekly level further down, and so on and so forth. So this is how you can set up your chart to see where could there be possible points of reversal. It is very important to remain patient when reaching such important levels, whether they're resistance or support. You will be able to protect your capital much better if you wait for a little bit of a confirmation to see which way price might actually head to next. In other words, wait for this candle to close today and see where we open tomorrow and how we act around these price levels. If we have claimed it, great, we can look up to the CC, the 786, and even this daily level up here. If, however, we show weakness and price begins to reject from this area, then we know which levels of support to check out. That was the short and sweet technical analysis update on Bitcoin. If you would like to find out about how to look at this more in detail, for example, using footprint software to get into possible day trades and scalp trades, then head on over to chartchampions.com where we have modules and can teach you how to use these tools to have more precise entries for possible scalp trades, day trades, and even swing trades. Also, tomorrow I will be doing the Friday morning update, which is a special weekly update for the members of the group where I go into detail about what's going on with Bitcoin, Ethereum, and some stocks. So if you're interested, then come join us. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Take care, and I'll see you on the next update. Bye-bye.